sitting in my car waiting for my wife to to finish up with a doctor's appointment because of covid they don't let me in <clears throat> a little quick message uh, i've been hit up a lot recently from uh gentlemen who have been going through a divorce been uh struggling with maintaining that relationship with their kids or even um you know kind of kind of stuck in what to do next right like going through a divorce um isn't easy <clears throat> and then also trying to figure out the di the dynamic of you being a father in your kids lives and what that looks like and from my personal experience and what i've learned here's what i tell people um and take it for what you want right maybe it works for you maybe it doesn't but this is for me i stopped um, feeling bad and sorry for myself, I stopped feeling embarrassed for myself because it's a little bit of an embarrassing thing to go through a divorce and have to explain it to people. It's just that, that awkward moment of, right? What I started to do was become better. And this isn't like a, a, a preach of what my company bettering is now, It's but essentially just how I've grown from where I was to where I am now, right? So I tell people, be better. Be the best version of yourself for your kids. In the end of the day, your wife might not be your wife anymore. Your relationship might, might have gone south, whatever it went. But those kids continue to be your kids. So give them the best version of you, right? So whatever you say you want to do or whoever you want to be, whatever you want to represent for them, start doing it, right? Drinking uh, is not the answer. It's never going to be the answer, but working out will be. Right, getting yourself in a better position, whether it be financially, emotionally, mentally, uh, can eventually get yourself prepared for the next relationship that potentially will fall in your lap, and you'll be a better person for it, and you'll be ready to receive that relationship in a more healthier mindset, and as well as hopefully fix all those little things that maybe were the reasons why the other relationship didn't work. Not taking the blame for all of it. I'm saying it's usually a 50-50 road and sometimes one one thing doesn't work, relationships go south. What I've worked on in my, my career, what I've worked on in my life is being better at communication. And I know that was a big issue for me. I, w I wasn't able to express. I would hold and hold and hold and hold and then i blow the foot, right? But that was me, right? There's other things that it, that I was bad at, right? But now I'm better at and, or, or acknowledging that Work isn't everything, because it used to be everything. When you commit to work and work gets 100%, your family gets second. So these little mindsets that I've learned is what I'd like to give to you today. Anyone that's listening, anyone that wants some information, I'd say this, be better. Fuck, get better. Get in better shape. Become a better dad. Be more relevant in their lives. Listen to them more. How can you become a better influence, a better leader, a better father for your kids, okay? And however you do that, trust me, down the road, 10, 20, 50 years down the road, they're gonna be like, man, they might've got divorced and that might've been an uncomfortable thing that everyone had to deal with. That might've caused a little bit of trauma, but you know what? Dad had his shit together. Try it. What's gonna hurt? If you try that, you're just gonna get better by trying. So, do it.